guys so uh, i wanted to come show you my messy hair and once again i'm sitting in the car because i'm waiting on my son um to get out of school or waiting for the bus to come but anyways this is what my hair is looking like it's frizzy as usual i don't mind i like it i think it fits my head my face um today is wednesday is it the 17th i'm not sure but it is wednesday and i know next week tuesday i get my second retwist done yeah 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 so let me wipe my teeth they're not looking too bright anyways um or stop drinking coffee that'll work too and red wine but anyways this is what it's looking like um it's budding i don't know if it's budding as much as i needed to bud but or it should be budding i guess um i can't wait till like a year's pass and i can get like some color in my head I'm trying to find a good piece I don't know I can, like, it's like I can feel when I'm not paying attention I'm not doing a video I can feel the buds like everywhere but then when I'm trying to record yeah let's see you guys see that one I don't know I don't know if you can see that or not but according to her my loctician, my hair is budding. The last time I was in there, and I could actually feel it more for when she said it um, last time, but I actually feel it this time, and I can see them. So it's doing something. I don't know when I'll fully be locked because I don't think I'm fully locked because I feel like I can just like comb this out. And yeah. What do you guys think? How's it looking? Is it doing what it's supposed to be doing? Um, this go around, since I got my first retwist done, um, I have not been doing as much stuff to it than I did before, or like I did before, even though last time I wasn't really doing anything much either. Like, before I was doing like, spritzing my hair, twice a week oiling it once a week and i've been doing even less than that since my last retwist i think i went a week where i didn't do anything to it oh wait i'm lying i think i did go a week and i happened to be near my rose water bottle so i went around and like spritzed it and then like that was it for that, for that week um, I do oil it occasionally. I think I've only oiled my hair twice since the last retwist. And it was with whatever of the three oils or three or four oils I have. Uh, I think I might have showed you guys last time, but these oils. I just grab whichever one happens to get in my hand and I like squirt like four lines, like four lines, like one, <laughs> two three and four i just squirt in there and then i like i rub it a little bit with my palms and my fingers like this this little motion and then that's it <laughs> so i just got finished um get my hair retwisted I don't know. I'm not sure about this mm, sort of middle part. I might not do this next time. I'm pretty sure I won't. I got to get used to it because it looks kind of wonky. But I wanted to try each thing. I think when I got my hair first in locks, um, I had a side part on like one side. And then the second, the first retwist, I had uh, a part on the opposite side. And this time I'm kind of going with a kind of middle part. But I don't think I like it. It shows all my little gray hair. Whatever this product is, she put in my hair. But 
She trimmed my ends a little bit, clipped them. And this is what it's looking like. I can't wait until they kind of get old because I think I prefer the old look. The little frizzy look because they look thicker. But yeah, this is what they're looking like. This is my second retwist. Mm -mm -mm. And they're looking more like locks now. Oh, I might as well go ahead and give you guys an update on my laser hair removal because I had that appointment today also. Um, I actually had that appointment today first and then right after I went to go get my hair retwisted. But let's show you. There's an ingrown hair right here and there was an ingrown hair right here. So she uh, caught herself um, focusing more on this and this this time around. So I'm hoping that they'll go away because I don't like, I mean, they make those spots, those, <clears throat> what you call it, hyperpigmentation or whatever, scars. And I did notice um, after the first laser hair removal this year that Wait, it wasn't this year because I did it in December, I think. I can't remember. But anyways, um, I did see some results because I noticed that the little hairs that would grow on my face randomly, there would be like fingerprints, like pinky print of like bald spots. Like, So she said it was a good thing. So it meant that those hairs that didn't grow back were actually in the phase that it needed to be in so they wouldn't return. So I just I'm hoping that this one and this one resolves itself. But um, like I said before, I paid for medium, but actually I paid for a small area, and then I wasn't sure if it was small area because I wanted her to do these random spots on my neck, little hairs pop up, and so I got a medium. But then she told me she would just charge me for a small because that's all I needed, and so she just she just does around here and she does around here like a little goatee area she does under here and then she'll do a little bit under here yeah so i need to start drinking more water like i was doing before because i'm getting breakouts and yeah i just wanted to do a short quick update all in one my locks finally got them done but I also wanted to mention the laser hair removal for those ladies who are watching do I recommend laser hair removal I definitely do um it works and I'm pretty sure the first time around a couple years ago when I got it done I did about six seven sessions I can't remember but I was supposed to go back I think after six months or a year and do another session and I never went so maybe that has something to do with uh, these random hairs that started coming up a couple years later I don't know either way I wanted to get it done again before they all turn gray and then they won't because the laser hair removal doesn't really work on the gray hairs so or I think red hair but yeah, I wanted to get it done before they all turned gray and then I just be walking around here looking like Santa Claus. Oh, don't forget to like the video, comment, subscribe if you haven't. I did want to mention a lot of these videos, I'm going to try not to even add music because ugh, people are so weird. You'll have like music that you find online that is uh, that is um free to use in your videos like for example one of my videos where I had like 20 some thousand views um I had it for like four years ago it was like a natural hair video of me taking my braids down after four months or something like that I had some music in there I found that was royalty royalty free or whatever and I don't know what happened but I looked it up and it's that company that put a copyright claim on my freaking video 
or that music it wasn't it was like a little beat or whatever the original company i got it from i guess sold or gave the rights to some other company maybe i don't know and then so like they're going on youtube and just copywriting everybody without i don't know i don't think that's fair but whatever but anyways don't forget leave a thumbs up thumbs up subscribe if you haven't and i will see you later bye bye